I want the community to talk about HR Open. I want them to understand that this is a journal for all of them. And I think I want HR Open to go beyond the narrow boundaries of who we are as clinicians, as scientists, as allied health professionals, and indeed as patients. I want the journal to speak to everybody who has an interest in reproductive medicine and for everybody to feel that it has something in it that is of interest, of relevance and of significance to them. I would advise authors who want their work to be read widely to publish in HR Open. I want authors who want their colleagues to know about the research they're planning, the research that they're doing and the result that they've completed to fruition to publish in it to give it its maximum exposure, both in geographical terms as well as reaching out beyond the narrow boundaries of the scientific community through to our patients, who after all are the people that we are conducting the research for. All this talk about openness, access and ac accessibility might lead people to think that this is about diluting science, and it is, isn't at all. This is about making good quality science accessible, not about dumbing down science for the non-scientific. All our articles in HR Open are going to be peer-reviewed to the highest possible standards. We want articles that will have maximum impact. Living where we now do in the 21st century, I think we see quality in a number of different dimensions one of which is certainly about citations, but there are other aspects to quality. It's about the impact of that piece of research, how it affects the way we undertake techniques, how it affects patient care, how it affects the way um, our clinical practice is viewed by our peers and by society as a whole, whether we can make lives better for the people we serve. I think that, to me, is how I would describe the overall quality of the journal and what it has ambitions to achieve. If you want three reasons why you want to publish in HR Open, it's for access, access and access. But behind that, it's about access to everybody, globally, within the scientific community, as well as within uh, the patient community.